back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a ultimate vanity makeover. It has been honestly my dream to create a ultimate get ready with me setup in my bedroom. Now that I finally bought my own dressing table, now that I'm honestly just a bit older and I've developed my love for makeup and skincare and being a content creator, I really want to have the ultimate get ready with me spot in my room. I am definitely a get ready with me lover. I love creating those types of videos. I love doing my makeup, doing my skincare and just having somewhere relaxing in my room to hang out I suppose and I've been doing quite a lot of room makeover videos on my channel in the past if you guys haven't checked those out I will link them all down below for you guys but today's video is dedicated to my dressing table vanity I guess. So I thought I could bring you guys along with me in this process and show you guys the before versus the after, what I did to make this aesthetic coquette but also functional. I really hope you all enjoy watching today's video and when down the way, let's get into the video. But starting off strong with the dressing table, when I first moved into this house with my family, the house was already furnished so that meant all my furniture in my room has been furnished since I moved in last summer. I did replace my bed back in January. Now it is time Time to do the vanity. I've actually had my eye on this vanity for a while and I'm not kidding this literally I could have sworn it used to be 300 pounds or anywhere between 250 and 300 pounds and that is just that is very expensive for furniture if you ask me. I wasn't down to pay that much money and then my mom was looking for furniture the other day and I noticed that the vanity was down to 150 pounds. Oh my gosh this this is my chance this is my opportunity. I'm so glad that I waited I'm just so happy that I got it for the price that I did. Remove the two posters that were above the brown like long desk taking all my stuff off of it and i'm gonna show you guys now that footage just taken off all of my bits and pieces from old getting ready with me area already with everything taken off it's made such a difference and I also hung up this painting that I found at a thrift shop now it is actually a ballerina I really love paint strokes in it just how it makes me feel so I bought it and I just hung that up now in my room before I had these two prints and they just were not my vibe at all so I'm so happy that I finally replaced that however I've still got this little gold hanging thingy I'm definitely probably gonna take down I just want to find something white to replace it with. IKEA furniture has also come now in two pieces on the floor and I'm going to wait for the guys to come build it today. I wanted to show you guys what I thrifted for my room. So I wanted to get two like jars or teapots that were very coquette, very cute and just like put ribbon around them and use one as a makeup brush holder and the other one for my hair brushes. And as well as them, I also wanted to find a plate to put my necklaces on. The jewelry always gets so messy and I just wanted to have a little tray for everything. Two little mason jars, they are identical. I literally got these for £1.50, which is so good. And then I just decided to wrap some ribbon around it. But as you guys can see, it's kind of, it needs to be fixed up. So I'm gonna cut them and make them all pretty. They are so cute, I love them. And I think they're really, really cute. And they are looking so much better than before. Two little mason jars with little bows on them. The bows weren't intentional, but because I used baby pink ribbon and I just tied them around, they give the kind of bow illusion, which, you know, I'm not complaining about because I'm definitely a bow lover. Another thing I mentioned was that I got a little plate to put my jewelry pieces on. I love this plate because it literally looks like a flower petal and I've just got gold bits, my silver necklaces, bracelets, rings, and then just earrings here. This one I thrifted. This is from Zara Home. Tied and this is from Primark Home. But I genuinely love just having really cute dishes to put my jewelry in. And then lastly, this piece is kind of random, but my mum actually got it for me. This ceramic floral dish. And you can never have too many dishes. I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to use this for, but I still think it's very cute. It is kind of random, but I guess that's what ceramics are for. You just fill them up with random little bits. <laughs> Thank you. 
so it is now the next day and my dressing table was all built i put everything away as well so now i'm gonna give you guys a finished dressing table tour it is so cute it is literally my dream just obsessed with all the decor all the organization and just how it's looking you've been contemplating whether to get this dressing table in particular i say go for it it is so worth the money and it is just beautiful firstly the mirror is so beautiful i love it it is basically just oval love it and it really makes my room look bigger hope for you guys there you guys can see my entire room and then above it i actually have the painting that i showed you guys earlier in this video but it is basically a ballerina i loved it and i just think it looks so pretty here first up is this little drawer so i've got my phone here but in this little drawer i just put my skincare and body care products so i've got all of my lip balms here vaseline my summer fridays jet lag mask another face mask and they're not super spacious but you can definitely fit stuff in them and then i have my heart pinterest mirror my two hair brushes and my setting spray obviously i know this is makeup and technically it probably shouldn't be in there but it works for now over here i actually have this little lilac crate it's from prime mark home and inside i just got my hair turbans and my headbands these are all just from different places so i just keep them here this one is for heatless curls just like my dressing gown robe and then you guys have seen this plenty but it's just my makeup bag i'm just gonna keep all my makeup in here i did recently go through it and just organize everything i've just got all my bits and pieces in there and now on this one i also have the matching jar from the other side i've just got my makeup brushes my eyelash curler and then my powder puffs and then this is my himalayan salt lamp Wah really just adds to the whole vibe i'm so obsessed with this it is so beautiful then i have another drawer this on that side on this side and i literally just filled this up with face masks eye gels a face mask at the bottom nose strip just like face masks and stuff in here i just wanted somewhere nice to put them and really quickly where everything is from this is from a store i found in town it's an independent store and the mason jars are from a thrift store and this mirror is from amazon this is from glossier and it's just their makeup bag and the dresser itself is from ikea but yeah that is basically the finished dressing table slash vanity i am so obsessed with it i know it's super minimal if you guys will enjoy watching this video i have everything mentioned linked down below for any of you guys that might want to purchase something i love you guys so much have an amazing day an amazing rest of your week bye